We're going to bring in Kelly Sadler, former special assistant to the president. Uh, Kelly, good to see you. Obviously, you're for Pence. Uh, what do you think the strongest point he made was? You know, I think the entire debate was strong for Vice President Mike Pence. And when you start, when you talk about COVID, which was the entirety of probably the first portion of the debate, I thought he laid out a very clear example of what exactly the Trump, you know, Pence administration has done. And he forced Kamala, and Kamala could not answer this question, what would you do differently? What exactly would you do differently? Because the truth of the answer is nothing. Everything that's in Joe Biden's plan for com confronting COVID-19, the president has already done. They're just not getting credit for it. And so I thought that that was very um, coherent. I think it was very well represented by the vice president. He was, he is the coronavirus task force leader of sure. all. Um, and, and then I also thought with Kamala Harris not being able to answer the court packing question, that was huge. She right. wasn't able to say if China was a foe or an en was an enemy or a friend. She wasn't. She defended JCPOA um, and, and totally ignored what this president has done to bring um, peace to the Middle East. And so I thought yeah. it was a great night for Pence, yeah. a really bad night Got for Kamala. Absolutely, Kelly Sadler and Alan Dershowitz. Thank you both so much. We're going to bring it back out here to the desk.